Hello, everyone. Welcome to Tube U China. I'm Henry. Last time, I have made a tripod accessory that mount my CCD camera. That is really simple, since it only contains a flat plate. Today, I will tell you my story how to make a universal tripod connector. I will not only tell you the final result, but also my every movement and consideration. My failure may become your experience. You would know why it will happen and how to escape the similar situation. Or maybe you don't want to hear my stupid and miserable story. Just jump to 5:15. Let's start. The commercial tripod connector looks like this. It seems very simple. I made my first movement without thinking. This is the design picture. The head bore is directly inside the chamber. You only need to print once without further construction. The idea seems quite brilliant, which indicates that I'm so naive. It is stuck as I expected. That's right. Since I have experience how to break it, this fidget cube is one of my favorite gadgets, decreasing the stress pressure. It is only printed one time and no further construction. You just rotate it and break the weak link between and inside that. You see, that works for me. Okay, use your force and break apart. Yeah, really broken. I can't find other remains since I threw it away immediately. Okay, let's increase the thickness of the wall and the neck. Print it again. Okay, it broke again without any question. Okay, I figured out that. Maybe the 3D printer in field density is not high enough. Increased to 100%. It took much longer time to print. This is the price which you get the quality. Am I right? My goodness, it's stuck again. I mean, it has limited space to move. No use at all. I have found that the commercial one has a slit. Oh, I see. That is the trick. What a foolish head I had! It should be considered in advance. Okay, the next version has a slit as you will expect. It looks nice. I'm quite confident. Oh no, it still broke from the neck place. I didn't expect that. In fact, fusing 360 can run the simulation before manufacture the parts. But unfortunately. I'm not reaching the point which can run the simulation so far. Okay, maybe searching internet is another option. I check a lot of footage, which tell you how to make a tripod connector. This video is one of the best answer for me. The design idea is brilliant. I printed it out and check. Really good for fixing camera. Except that the 3D printed head is too weak in my case. This is not the fault of design, but the weak material which 3D printer used for printing. Okay, I knew where is the important points to take care. One is the neck linked to the camera. Another is the contact part related with the rotation bore. I choose the stainless steel board instead of 3D printer filament material PETG or PLA. Make sure you have chosen the correct size of the board, a quarter inch, 20 UNC thread. The weak point in this version is decreased as much as possible. It is almost indestructible, but the rotation part has problem. While handling heavy camera, also the freedom is not as good as I expected. It seems my tech fan is still 
best choice for me now. If some other ideas are really good, such as this type, but I'm still like the ball type, since you can change the ball head with commercial one. I also make some modification. I change the eccentric screw to over screw. Also, the flat leveling up part is changed to a round shape. The printing is smooth without any problem. Let's check if it is work. Perfect. If you use a stainless steel screw for test, it is almost indestructible in this case. The ball head size is 1 inch, about 25 mm diameter. I have put the file in the link below. You can download it for test. Till now, I have finished my tripod connector. Maybe it will modify again. Hope you can get some idea from my experience. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Also, click on the small bell so you will not miss the updates. Tube channel is waiting for you.